All right. So before we go on to Flaming Balance Beam, that is a great name for a title. Uh, that's a Let's great name for a level. Up. Let's get treated a little. Hey, we got enough money for another weapon here. Welcome. Okay, who needs who needs a weapon? Unfortunately, potato is garbage. Armor is expensive. Um. Hmm. Did I get one for geese? Nope. The geese needs a weapon. There we go. Problem solved. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do some heavy item worlding stuff. Oh, hey, we got an event. Uh, between levels, just so I can get more money. <laughs> Plus, I want to make a, uh, you know, Grand Slam Man super OP some more. Okay. Hey, bro, what kind of relationship do you have with Seraphina, sis? That that question again. It's nothing special. We're just members of the same rebel army. You don't have to be embarrassed. Sir Kilia has the hots for my beauty. Only in your dreams. You always say such cold things, but why do you always come to my rescue when I'm in danger? I can't turn my back on someone who's suffering because of the lost. Oh, ho, ho, ho. stop blushing, Sir Kilia. Very well. Let's just leave it at that. Uh, what's wrong, Zroken? Hmm. You two look awfully lovey-dovey to me. Why is this happening? <laughs> I do like that a lot. The one-sided love line between the two of them. It just like feels you? right. I don't know. I do hope that they manage to flesh out uh, Seraphina's character a little bit more than this, though. Uh, that might not have been the best choice of words, but whatever. Is something wrong, Sir Kilia? I can't imagine Goldion losing to Void Dark so easily. But if he lost, then it must have been because of that old scar. If that's the case, I don't think I can look Goldion in the eye. Bro, you're such an idiot! Man, you're such a meanie, bro. You're supposed to let my hard-boiled fist hit you, realize you're letting your past control you, and then change after shedding a tear. Really? Sorry. Don't apologize. You're a demon. You're embarrassing me. Thank you for your kindness. But no matter what I try, I can't escape my past. Sir Kilia, why do you dwell on the past so much? Is it possible that you're still hiding something from us? I see what they mean about the balance beam. All right, let's go mess them up. Uh, let's see, who's low level? Looks like it's, uh, well. This has been a long day coming. So here's what we're gonna do. Let's go. Two things, oops. Let's go. Didn't go far enough with him. I really haven't gotten to use Red Magnus in a little while. Let's go party time with Red Magnus and Bring Death Santa along for the ride, just because that's what Death Santa does. Tay. And then maybe capture a couple people. Tay. I don't know. I'm kind of lo I'm kind of lazy about that. So let's do physical gain. Yeah. Super. Yahoo I need to change your voice actress. No, I need what? They're running away. <laughs> what? Get back here! I want to kick the shit out of you. Wait. Come on. It's ass kicking not time. Do you not get what ass kicking time means? How much we do not have a whole lot of uh, SP left, do we? Well, all right. Let's do a silver slugger. I'm coming for you. You know what? Let's actually skip past it, this one. It has a really, really long animation. Oh, geez. They actually do a lot of damage.
You know what? Fuck it. I'm just pressing triangles until they they stop making that god awful noise. I can't deal with it. Okay, special. Can we reach with mega heal? Not even close. Well, let's just do a Great. couple combo. She might die though from this. He fuck. God damn it. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Red Magnus needs defense badly. Real badly. <laughs> okay, whatever. Um, what else am I gonna do? It's my turn. So we'll just go up here for the time being. I'm going for it. I might actually have to use my whole team. I was hoping I could just beast it with uh, Red oh. Magnus, but it looks like that's not the case. Anyway, I'm gonna just throw a bunch of my support moves. I don't actually know if they work though. Oh well. Mega Star, Gloomy Tears, Heal. I actually don't know if ca if just cold casting my um, my basic abilities does anything. Ooh, hello. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. Super Olympia. Does that get him? Oh, that gets him all his HP back. Well, that makes this kind of concerning. All of a sudden, uh, why don't we do? She can't do shield, can she? Well, that's a problem. Uh, physical gain. We'll just do a small boost on that. And we're going to do Steel Arm Lariat and just murder everybody. Okay, this I'll works. You. <laughs> right. Yeah, it does level up their skills. I don't know if it gets some experience, but I guess just you can repeatedly cast... Ow! You can just repeatedly cast... Um, Support skills over and over and over again. Yeah. Oh right, I forgot. Never, never bother boosting Death Santa's resistance. His resistance is insane. Health not so much so. Probably gonna die here. Nope, not dead yet. Wow, Death Santa, you are a tank. Two thousand hit points. Did not realize Death Santa had that much. And of course, can heal it all back. All right, so first and foremost. Let's make some room. We got a, uh... Ooh, hey, overload. We got a... Time for giant press. Okay. Oh, apparently he can't move. Don't know why. Anyway, let's just go with the murder. What else can we do? I can't even tell how these guys are lined up. Are they, like, both next... Ah, oh, that's awkward. Alright, whatever. I can just do... I can do pur Purgatory Palm. We might as well just do Exploding Tiger. You're busy, you're busy, and everybody else is stuck back here. Alright, whatever. This is going to be effective. The Mondo party members are really effective. Damn, 4,000 damage. I, I was thinking about it, it's like, who would win in a fight? Killia or, or uh, Red Magnus? I think the answer is just flat out Red Magnus. I also just realized his speed goes down to 1. When he's in revenge mode. That's kind of great, actually. Okay. Mastery up. Oh, probably armor mastery. That's how it works. Actually, let's move. Let's get out of the way. I don't know if Red Magnus can reach it. He can't move. Why can't he move? Oh, he's, he's paralyzed. All right, fine. Well, we might as well walk Seraphina up and just attack Lance. But I don't know, actually know if, how that works with uh, skills. Oh, well. Special Purgatory Palm. I do want to level it up. Really, that doesn't kill Roland. Huh. I'm surprised that didn't... That didn't do enough damage to kill him. All right. Well, I guess the rest of the way, maybe Usalia can do? Yeah, Usalia has the movement speed for that. Yes. Let's actually use her flatty dance. I almost never use it. Because it's a physical attack, and she does not have the physical damage. Oh, well. Should wait till Killia gets his overload and then see who would win. I, that's an interesting question. I have not seen his overload. I wonder when he gets it. Probably at the end of this chapter. Two characters have surrendered and got some money. Kill ya. 
What happened? Are you out of curry? I would like to eat some curry, but I'm more worried about you. <laughs> For a child to worry about me, I have failed as an adult. When it comes to worrying about the person who saved your life, it doesn't matter who's a child or an adult, Clip. You're right. I'm sorry for treating you like a kid. Kilia, you're still dwelling on your history with Goldion. You're right. But what's that got to do with you? I'm the same way. Why do we constantly drag our past behind us? That's not a question I can answer. But I can say this. I'm only still alive because I have been dragging my past behind me. If I can defeat Void Dark, then I... You're only still alive because you've been dragging your past along. I'm the same, Plip. If not for the sake of getting revenge for my parents, I would probably have died from despair by now. Can revenge be the only reason for someone to live? I'm not so sure about that. <laughs> I'm not so sure I should be talking to a child about this. Ah! You're treating me like a child again, Flip! Alright. So, uh, before we went into the last episode, we totally forgot something important. We forgot to do the interrogations. First and foremost, we get healed. At least we're making a lot of money now, but then again, I've been putting less points into experience. Oh, shoot, we've got an event. Of course we got one. And that's why Usali is under a spell that makes me constantly have to eat curry. Plip. Wah! You startled me. A little girl like you has been through so many rough times. Z Zorokin is easily moved. Would you like a tissue? And you're so sensible! Huh. You guys are making me cry even more. It's hard to believe you're demons. I agree with you on that point. But what'll happen to Asalia when that spell symptoms show up? First, my body temperature will rise. I'll get lightheaded. I'll become restless, Plip. Yes, yes, and then? After that, it's like, whoa! And then I become very scary, Plip. Whoa? No, it's like, whoa! Plip. Sorry, that isn't scary at all. Hmm. It may be a little bit difficult to imagine it unless we see the actual thing. You don't get it, Plip? It's Guo Plip! Guo! Yep. Yep, okay, I get it. Why are you getting why are you petting you, Sally or Plip? Oh, I I didn't mean to, but I really calmed down. I see, it's just like caring for a small animal. I understand how he, that feels. God damn it. Alright, let's let's uh, let's do some beautiful, beautiful interrogation. Look in those soulless eyes. And feel the ultimate suffering. How much damage does this do? A little bit less than, uh... A little bit less than, uh... What's her face? No? It's, wow, how many people am I interrogating? Jesus Christ. That's, that was like everyone. How many people do I have? We've killed a lot of people here. Okay, so we got a couple of things we can do. Either we can turn them into a stat shard, which is good, but I can wait on that one for a while. Let's go, let's go and improve some of these squads. Okay, organize squad. Uh, capture squad. So what happens if I increase this? I can increase the squad limit, and I can... Uh, that helps, but that's not important right now. This increases the effect of the interrogation, but, I mean, it only takes one round to do so anyway. Okay. Let's see, members get 10% of the leader, uh, experience leader gains. That's useful. This is the mana that the leader gains. Don't care about relief party, giant killer squad, nope. Foot soldier squad, nope. We're looking for the really useful ones. I like the idea of pressing square to see enemy thoughts, but we'll work on that one later. Probably after we've kind of beaten the game. Defense outpost. This isn't bad, but it's not that useful. And it definitely doesn't level them up that fast. This one could be useful. If only because it would, um... It would make passing bills a lot faster and a lot easier. Support group, care world stats, we'll look into that later. Um... 
This one might actually be the one to put points into. Enhance the Nether Research Squad. Squad limit plus one, half the rate of collapse. Squad limit plus two, double the speed of research. That seems like it'd be useful. Otherwise, we can put points into Life Support Unit for double jumping. You can attack in town and triple jump, which isn't that great. Curry Capture Squad. So yeah, why don't we why don't we put points into this for the time being? Uh, how do we enhance it? There we go. S Strengthen Squad. How many levels can I put into this? I just want to get it up to level five if I can. There we go. Perfect. I'm gonna need Let's actually send some people out to do some research. What? Okay, because we've got, ooh, San Kano or Tummy Ache Netherworld. Research it. We've got a bunch of people send out too, so, ooh, actually, you know what? No, that was, that was not a good idea. Uh, I want to keep, I want to keep Azuna around for item world stuff, so we'll send Griselda, Captain Soggy, Flip Phone, pretty much all of these people that I never use. There we go. Uh, should be good to go. Bye, guys. Anything else to do? Nope. Senator Squad's only good if you can get all the way. If you can't, uh, your own people would vote nay. Really? I want to take a look awesome. at that one again. That'd be kind of annoying. Uh, what is it? Dark Assembly Squad. Oh yeah, members will vote aye. Okay. I will look into. I will look into boosting that one. Wait, how big is this squad? Why does it say zero out of three? Switch details? No. Switch squad. Why does it say a zero out of three? I don't... Oh, zero out of three currently in the squad. That makes sense. Okay, we'll look into that one later, though. What did you just say? Four billion hell? Yes? Is everything really gonna be okay, dude? It's perfectly fine. I hope so, dude. But I seriously think you should return soon. Hmm. Madam Serafina? How is Father doing? Has he said anything about me? No, I haven't heard anything, dude. I see. Tell Father, don't worry about Serafina. She's okay. All right. <laughs> so you're worried about your old man after all? Ooh, Serafina Sis has a surprisingly cute side. Uh, how long have you been there? Don't worry about Serafina. She's okay. Since about there. You two have crossed the line of common decency to be eavesdropping on a lady's conversation. Hey, you two. Are you still alive? There's no response. They must be nearly corpses, Blit. The Rebel Army. In the name of the Lost, we won't let you pass. They seem to be hesitating. That probably means Demon General Bloodus' injuries are pretty severe. We need to push. Let's take Sand Kano back from the Lost. Alright, Sandstorm effect is active. G none, recovery, enemy boost. Ooh, that hurts a little. Might... Give me some opportunities here. Uh, I see. Okay. Hmm. This is awkward, but I can do it. So what we want to do... You Red guys, Magnus. Let's super go! Please tell me you have the throwing range on this one. And uh, we're going to need to lob a couple of people over. We need somebody with a ranged attack. Uh, can shoot up there. Probably Salia. I hope. Okay, well, one way or another. She's going. Good luck. We're going to start chucking things across. I kind of wish you could have flying units that would fly over those gaps. I'm surprised that they don't exist in this game. Anyway, uh, let's see. We've 
got a bunch of axe dudes over here. But if they're not on my area, that's not a big deal. Oh, hey. That means I can have a defender out. Which means ah. Vi. Of course, this is enemy boost. I don't know, man. We'll let them come all the way out to the sand. Oh, shoot. This is an invasion <laughs> level. Alright, this is going to be interesting. Okay, so we've got the archer taken care of. Actually, that makes my life easier. Special. Or not taken care of so much as just moved. Uh, let's send... Let's, go. let's send Killia the... as well. Just in case. Ah, crap. We're not gonna be able to hit anything from here, are we? I need to get him a long-range move somehow. Oh, you know what? Really? Do I not have any back good backup guns? Oh, right. It's because all of these are kind of garbage. Which one's the best? Uh, Netherworld Musket, I guess. Alright. Am I just not within range? Here, let's try switching these. Okay, now we can attack. Does a fair amount of damage. He's not very good with guns. Or, he's okay with guns. But he definitely ha doesn't have the skill with it. Okay, flying units exist, they just can't fly over gaps. Just hover over poison, apparently. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. So let's bring out Vi, we'll hang out. This should be fine. Because, yeah, what we want to do is move up here and attack green. Which is more work than I think it's going to... Oh, what if I can do this? There we go, problem solved. Alright. Okay. Let's Let you. let's just mash triangle a bunch, and hoodwinked. Bye. Okay. So here's the question: Can you lift Kilia and throw him up there? Yeah, you can. All right, that makes this easier. So yeah, all of all of the enemies that we uh, currently have can't reach us, which makes this really easy. I like doing geo change stuff just because it makes me happy. Okay. So yeah, all we have to do is walk Killy up, and nobody's going to be able to figure this out, will they? Yep. Oh no, they're just going to stand down there semi-uselessly. They actually managed to get a hit in. That's fine. Not a big deal. Uh, let's see. Well, you we don't want to do anything that knocks it off. I'll just work on Exploding Tiger. If he missed here, I'd be kind of sad. Anyway, watch the magic. It's not going to kill anybody. But it's great for my boost, Shane. It is great for my boost, Shane. So, now that we've got everybody uh, hmm, nice and sitting around with their pants down, let's see what da what kind of damage we can do to them. Let's do a magic change spear. I don't do this for... Uh, I don't do it often enough. I do it often. But I don't do it often enough, as far as I'm concerned. And we should be able to... Oh, really? That's a shame. Apparently haven't boosted the range enough on that one to hit the square. I really should actually boost up the capture skill on that one. Oh well. Let's see, can you hit a square with your star spell? Probably not. Really? Note to self, get more mana. And soon. Oh right. She's monstrously large. Uh, you know, I'm just going to go this way. Because this is going to do some damage. Well, whatever Potato and Christo can't kill, Seraphine is going to murder. Okay, good. That didn't hit Christo. I was worried about that for a second. Sniper has been mastered. Outlaw has been obtained. Okay. And we might as well just summon Death Santa and do a physical boost. Uh, okay, looks like we're good. Well done. Hmm. More enemies have come out of the base paddle. <laughs> oh yeah, they're they are summoning more of those things. Yes. 
Now this looks like a smorgasbord. Oh, I've never seen this one before. Is he sniping her in the crotch? Oh, right. He... As far as that cutscene was concerned, he missed. Watch, watch where he aims. Yep. Oh, wait, no. Straight in the thigh. I was like, this is kind of disturbing, honestly. I'm actually really disappointed with the cutscene, uh, with some of these cutscenes. Just the generic backgrounds and the, the art in this game. Like, disguise games are pretty, but they really did not put enough into the budget, apparently. Okay. Oh, we can capture somebody. I mean, if I was obsessive about it, I could probably capture all of these folks. Never mind, can't capture them all. In fact, screw it. I don't care. If I'm gonna do if I'm gonna do capturing, we might as well just do capturing in in the um, in the item world where it's easier, where everybody has no HP, and you can just capture everyone. Why attack when you can giant press? Oh wait. I forgot, Serafina was standing in the middle of that. Turns out, Serafina, when giant, still has massive, uh, has a really high speed stat. Holy crap, yeah, wow, hitting her must be difficult. Especially with that pitiful sp Yeah, so, apparently giant mode actually gives you an, a smorgasbord stat up, as long as you're not in, um... It, it gives you a stat up as long as you're not Red Magnus, apparently. Good to know. Okay. Speaking of, we might as well do. Let's go. We might as well do some things over here. I guess I should probably chuck her back, or somewhere. I guess she can slowly walk. Red Magnus is done for, but who cares? Let's see, Demon Solace. Oh right, I was gonna level that skill up more. Apparently you can't improve the range of it, unfortunately, but meh. <laughs> In a train watching this. Wow, didn't know you'd have good enough internet speed to watch somebody on Twitch on a train. Not bad. I, I guess if you're in, like, Korea, you could probably have really good internet no matter where you are. Oh, could be somewhere else. Or you could just have the most impressive phone... phone line I have never heard of. Okay, so she's in... She's in revenge mode. We need to use and abuse this. Uh, you know what? Yeah, if I stand her right here, that'll be good enough. Perfect. Special. Squad attack. Is that... No, oh, that's not gonna murder them all. Well, that's gonna murder them all. I guess we can get Kilia to come over here and take out the Let's healer. Go. Perfect. Okay. Uh, being big ups your stats substantially. I will keep that in mind. I don't... Oh, I know exactly what I'm gonna use that for, come to think of it. What I'm going to do is, uh, for the very final boss, I'm going to have an extremely overpowered, uh, Grand Slam Man gone play? giant. Oh. Thank you. She didn't actually kill the, the final messenger. That's a shame. Alright, fine, let's just walk, uh, her mondo ass all the way up there. Wow, that poison does a lot of damage. All right, let's see what I can do. So I'd like to do a capture skill, but I don't think we get the chance. All right. Let's just beat him to death with Kilia. Perfect! And we get target lock. Hey, handy. Actually, a lot of these are pretty good. Crystal! Long time no see. Is everything going smoothly? Of course it is. What do you take me for? Wow, Crystal! You must be a genius! Are you making fun of me? No, no, no. What are you saying? I don't think anyone in our organization has more faith in your abilities than I do. I'm elated to discover that I have such a nosy superior who is the only one who understands me. Oh, it makes me want to cry. Well, it's fine, really. This ordeal will soon be over. At this rate, that ridiculous accusation that I'm a spy for Void Dark will be proven false. 
then I will exact my revenge on those who set me up in the first place. Nice. Sounds like you're ready to go. You can do it. I believe in you. It doesn't matter if you believe in me or not. I will accomplish this. Whew. I talked all big, but we still lack the strength to confront Demon Emperor Void Dark. More allies? No. I have to find pawns that I can use. Alright. We are motoring through this, but I'm okay with that. Let's do the nice little pretty spin. Let's and heal up. up. Oh, of course, we got another event. Since I'm not playing as Killy, I don't see them anymore. So I have to actually seek them out. Really? My, you didn't know? I'm the richest in all the three worlds. The Princess Overlord of Gorgeous, Seraphina. She's also the biggest shrew in all the three worlds. Silence. Huh, that's weird. After hearing that, I can sense a hint of class in everything you do. Zerokin's heart is honest, Plip. Is it? Mahaha! <laughs> He's so simple-minded! I don't want Red Magnus to say that about me. Oh, <laughs> it's natural to recognize my class. There's nothing to feel bad about. But for a rich per person, you don't seem to have any gold bling or giant pearl accessories. There's none in your pocket, Netherworld, either, Plip. I have too many jewels, but I left them all in Gorgeous. If I had brought them with me, they'd just take up space. Besides, if I want some, I can get them right away, so I don't really care. Did you forget about that Uh, did you forget that you ran away from home? Ah, don't mistake me for a brainless monkey like you. Think carefully. If I brought them to my pocket netherworld, then the Prinnies would steal them whenever they want. I wouldn't be able to fight if I had to worry about that. It's all for the best in the end. What? It's all for the best in the end? Does that mean... Oh, ho, ho, ho. Usalia, would you stop retorting now? And we got another one. Everyone, may I have your attention? I have a question for you. What's wrong, Christo? You seem so serious. Are you needless... Are you needlessly worrying about something? It's okay. You can probably beat Blutus, Plip. Yes, it, it's not that. I'm simply curious, but what would you do if you encountered an angel in the Netherworlds? What, be, what makes you ask such a thing? Are you saying there's an angel around here? No, it's just a hypothetical question. I've never met an angel before, so I wanted to ask you guys. I can't say anything until I find myself in that situation. I don't know. Super kill him half to death? Red Magnus is right. I heard that all angels look down on demons. If you think rationally, he would be murdered for being in the netherworlds. If he's a super hateful guy, then of course he'd be murdered. First of all, can you even do something as intricate as beating someone half to death? Heh, <laughs> don't compliment me. Don't compliment the Supreme One. You're making me blush. That's Red Magnus's splendid characteristic of thinking those words were complimentary. Plip. What's wrong, Christo? Your body's shaking. Uh, it, it's nothing. <laughs> Called it a long time ago. Probably the moment we saw him, really. All right, what are we going to do? Nothing. We're going to buy some equipment, I think. Armor. Because I think I've... Got everybody else topped out. Uh, I don't feel like giving him armor. Well, I mean, I could, but... I was thinking giving her some more armor. Right, because she's lower on the defensive side just because I've given her such a high health boosty item. Speaking of, we haven't gotten a reward from the, um... Hospital in quite a while. Oh, well. 